Hi, I'm Frank Cherubino with the Palm Beach Post. I'm here at the Trump rally today to talk to some of his supporters, and if I'm lucky, even engage in a little locker room banter. Well, have you always been a Trump supporter? Yeah, well. Since, uh, since, since last yeah, year? Yeah. So all this stuff recently hasn't changed your mind? No, but he needs to tone it down just a twinge. Like, like a twinge, so like instead of saying like the P word, maybe use the C word? <laughs> no. <laughs> I bet a million bucks that you're Democratic. You okay. Are you? Oh well, yeah, I am. Yeah, I am. Okay, I am. I am. Oh, I'm not trying to push it. I'm just talking to you. But I'm just, I'm just honest. Bias news reporting. No, it's just who I am. It's just who I am. It's who I am. It's who I am. I'm not on TV, but I do admit it. Okay. No, I'm not pushing it. I'm just asking you questions about it. I just find it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's pretty rude. Well, I don't know. And why do you support Trump? I support him because he's going to make America safe again. I believe he, he's a fabulous businessman. He mm -hmm. is a true patriot. Mm -hmm. uh, he's a fabulous father to his children. Uh, right. He's done I'll a lot hold you, How about I hold your umbrella? So well, I'm I don't fall on us. So. Oh, yeah. Um, All right. I was going to try to do a lot for women, but I guess uh, I can't. Well, so okay, so let's, let's do some harmless locker room banter, you and I, right now, okay? Well, all right, here we are. We're here. Here's one. Hey, ma'am, come here for a second. What do you think? Of, we're doing, we're engaging in locker room banter. What's your name? Uh, Margaret Williams. Margaret Williams. Okay, you've got a nice set of legs. What do you think of her legs? I think she's absolutely beautiful. I what would you like to do with her legs? I haven't looked at her legs, but I think she has a beautiful pair of legs. I think she's a beautiful woman. I'm actually uh, young myself, but I'm into uh, women who are older than me. So really? Her, it's not just her legs, it's her face. There's an aura that says, screams out beautiful to me. Yeah. And I wouldn't say I want to do anything with her legs. I would just want to say... All right, enough talking. Just kiss her on the lips. I'll give her a kiss on the cheek because I'm, I'm Hispanic. Do you believe that somebody, when they're 59 years old, they're still sort of forming their personality and that they really haven't reached full adulthood yet? Like, like for example, you mentioned people 13 years old saying using the word gay as a substitute for bad. Well, you could say, well, they're 13-year-old kids and they're going to grow up. Do you believe when somebody's 59, they really shouldn't be judged on what they say because what really matters is what happens, what they say when they're 69 or 70? Well, look, the way I see it is this. It has nothing to do with age. It has to do with culture. Uh, our culture has been increasingly advancing towards uh, political correctness. We've been, we've been uh, moving towards, towards uh, uh, a language where we try not to offend people as much. So, I mean, I think that's a great thing. But, you know, 11 years ago, uh, it was a lot different. And, and here's another thing. Um, um, I believe that Donald Trump, if anything, he was just trying to impress a, somebody who was meeting. I, I don't know the full story. He was yeah. trying to impress somebody he was meeting for the first time. Let me get behind the sign. There you go. Great. How about we'll have a Trump? How about we'll have a media sandwich? Two women for Trump and Frank Cherubino with the Palm Beach Post. This is a this is a Trump sir. Yeah, it's, it's called a Cherubino sandwich. I have two pieces of white bread next to me. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. you. What level of sexual assault would be too much for you? No level of sexual assault. What's that? No level of sexual assault. But, but is grabbing, okay. have you ever been grabbed by somebody like that? Like, Without like, introduction? Absolutely. It's offensive. But I haven't, you know, if anybody's grabbed, it's offensive. Right. So, so but that's what I'm saying is if you're still going to vote for him and he says that's what he does, what level of sexual I assault? That was just talk, like I said. So that he's was just, just bragging. Talk room talk. He was just, just. I mean, I, I can tell you right now. He wasn't in a locker room, though. If somebody, well, you know what? I hate to bring up who's who and stuff, but I've heard females talk worse. Okay. I mean, you know. What's that? I'm sorry. Females talk worse when they're in a. Did group. you see? Because I don't. The same thing. So tell me about that, because I don't get to hear females. When oh, they, no. What do they talk about? <laughs> that's that's private. Do you have you ever had a powerful guy come up to you and just put the moves on you without saying word one? No. Would you think that's offensive? Yeah, Depends I, how rich he is or what? No, I mean, if it was an actual move, no, I wouldn't like that. Yeah, yeah. So you don't think Trump did that? Absolutely not. So you think when he told Billy Bush that this is what he does, he doesn't even talk to him, he just goes and grabs him, you think that was just boasting? Well, I just think, you know, comparatively to what Hillary has done. It's really of no issue. Somebody's just taking my. Hey, excuse me. That's my umbrella. Make my umbrella great again. I need it. Okay. It's really of no issue. Uh huh. Yeah. You don't think it's an issue? No. So what level? What not. level of sexual I'm assault becomes to, an issue? I'm looking for somebody to lead our country and right. not lie to us. Okay. All right. So Trump doesn't lie. 
Uh, no, I don't think so. Yes, I don't see that he did anything. That um, he may have said a few words. It was behind closed doors. But he said words. He said words that. about what he has done in the past. He's basically admitted to sexual assault. Isn't that what he did? Listen, a lot of women will banter back and forth. I'm a woman. Oh, okay? good. All right, that's what I want to hear. Okay. Tell me. All right, now we're in a women's locker room. Imagine I that I'm, I'm a woman. Women's locker room. All right. Room all right. Anytime. All right. Check out Joe Frazano. Check out my guy over there. What do you think? I nice package. Nice yeah, package. Uh, okay, well, I'm not Let's go, go grab it. What do you I, think? I, I gotta go. Thanks for talking. <gasps>